Hi, I'm Monre Bergdorf. I'm a model and activist. I'm very lucky that I get to do a lot of different things. They all point back to activism. I like to use fashion and beauty as a way to um, get people thinking because ultimately, you know, we all dress, we all express ourselves, we all have a look, an aesthetic that we feel comfortable with. So just getting people to challenge themselves and think a little deeper than what, you know, the visual is. I want kids to grow up feeling empowered in their queerness or their race or their sexuality or their social economic background. So less shame, more empowerment, more understanding and empathy for everybody. My life is actually full of joy and the trans community is full of joy. Joy is a radical statement, it's a form of resistance, but it's also a fact. I spent so much of my life not being able to express myself through clothes, so that is how I express myself now. It's empowering to see yourself in the mirror and it reflect how you feel. And that is ultimately the trans experience. Comfy can be glam as well. I mean, this is what we're rocking today and it's comfy and it's, you know, understated, I think. <laughs> you can be rocking massive Louboutins and feel comfortable in who you are and how you feel. It may not be a physical comfort, but it's an emotional one. Beauty is something that I've learned to see past the visual. I don't need to be dressed for nines to feel beautiful. I used to feel that way. I am still the same woman, regardless of whether or not I'm dressed up or if I'm dressed down or if I'm naked or with nothing on my face or body. I'm still the same woman, so I try to feel that same beauty regardless of what I'm wearing. That's the great thing about being a woman. We're all so many different kinds of women all in one. People are multifaceted and I try to embrace all those different facets.